Broadcasting live from the heart of Western Colorado, News Channel 5 at noon starts now. We got Chef Lenny in the house and he's talking everything pumpkin pie. Don't go anywhere. Welcome back. Thanks for staying with us. I'm joined with Chef Kenny from the Kessler Canyon, a beautiful ranch resort in Tibet Canyon. I can't wait to hear all about it. But let's get right into this. You're making bourbon pumpkin pie. Daggum. There, Megan. What we're going to do is we're going to take this pumpkin, cut it right in half. Okay. Take the seeds right out. You put it on a baking sheet just like that, and you throw it right into the oven. I've always wondered how you get those pumpkin pie goodies out of there. Well, you know, you got to just roast that off, and then you send it through a little robo coop, and you puree it up real okay. nicely. Put some of that evaporated milk, sugar, okay. cinnamon, nutmeg, touch of love. Touch of love, that's Gotta have a touch of love. Okay, so now, voila, we've got our pumpkin pie. We have this beautiful pumpkin pie that we cooked all western style in this Dutch oven. Okay, then and what? Then what we're going to have you do here is take that bowl and we've got some nice meringue. And here's another way to take, some, uh, take a pumpkin pie and bring it somewhere else. Just like those lemon meringue pies. Oh, okay. We're going to take some. Let me show you at home the consistency of this. It looks amazing just like this. And this and is going on the pumpkin pie. That's right. We're going to put some cranberries in there. Okay. Because so we all love cranberries. A little tart to add to that sweet of that pumpkin pie. That's what I was wondering, how that adds to it. But it's Get the tart. Get that right in there nicely. Okay. You're doing well. Thank you, Chef Lenny. Now, what else are you adding to this? We're going to add some bourbon. Oh, this is where the bourbon comes in. Some of in. that beautiful peach street bourbon. Okay. From down on Palisade. Oh, we'll put okay. that right in there. Mix it around. Mix that right around and then uh, let's bring it right on top of this pie right here, baby girl. Okay. So how much do I use? Just the whole thing? Yeah, put the whole thing right on there. The better, the more the better. Ooh, I can kind of smell that bourbon. You like that, don't you? It smells pretty good. Makes you, makes you think of where we're, what's going to be happening later on in the day. <laughs> uh, maybe. Okay, so now tell me, so, this looks good. Do you cook this? What yes, do you do? we want to put this in a 375 degree oven. Okay. For about, I'd say about 15 minutes. Okay. Let's throw it in the oven. And then when you got it out, it'll look just like this. So that oven for how long? This is 15 minutes at 375. 15 minutes. Okay. And that's just to kind of do what? Kind of like tone down the bourbon taste? Or? You want it, yeah. You want to bring down the bourbon taste and you want to crunch up the top and set up that meringue. Okay. So the meringue does, isn't so fluid, it'll crunch a little bit. And then right before you serve oh, it. Oh man, that scares me a little bit. Absolutely. Okay. We're gonna bust out the blowtorch. Okay. And we're gonna make, we're gonna just singe those little, those little edges on the top of it, just like that. Oh, look now, at that, beautiful. Is this, okay, I've always wondered about this. Is this for looks or is it for actually some good taste? This is gonna add that, this is gonna add a great look, which is, you know, we eat, we eat with our eyes, first thing. But it's also gonna give us that taste of a nice s'mores. Really? Like we've been cooking on the fire. It looks amazing. And then, plus, chicks think you're cool when you're carrying oh, I bet. butane I bet. acetylene torches. Well, thank you so much for being here. And again, I really want to make sure all of you know Kessler Cannon, this a beautiful ranch out in Tibet. Chef Lenny is there. He's got all the questions that you need answered. And if you want to reach him, you can give them a call at 283-1145 or go visit them. They have a beautiful setup there. Thank you so much for being here. Thank you very much for having me. Stay with us. We'll be right back after the break.